so um welcome back to dark souls 3 in this particular episode uh we're back to the dragon salaya boss fight area which apparently um i'll be going to the next boss fight which will probably lead us to the last lord of cinder finally it is a long ass load screen it took me like 15 seconds to get there and okay let me just check whatever is in here uh this may be a bit long episode uh due to the fact that this area is a little bit a little bit time consuming because it's, it's almost like a maze so i had to apologies i had to i had to pretty much look up uh the, a walkthrough in order to get away because I am afraid to get lost and I might wait too I might waste too much time because you know what's gonna happen soon the ringed city is gonna be coming soon and I don't wanna I don't wanna finish this game right after it came out I wanna finish this game right before it comes out so let's go up here it seems like there's only one item there I didn't really care much um, did I turn on my FX oh yes I did I did. Let's just, you know, turn on some stuff. Apologies if I'm doing this right on screen. I don't really want to do much editing in this episode because, like I said, I'm really, really busy with life in general. And what the fuck? Why is there a bonfire right next to another one? Namco, what are you doing? <laughs> is there weed? Is there weed in freaking, you know... Japan or something? I mean, like, what the hell? This does this work? There's literally a bonfire, like I don't know, like a few kilometers away from it. What the hell? You can literally see it from here. You can see both bonfires at the same moment. That's, that's interesting. Is there anything there? Let's see, like, oh, well, the key was given me right in front of, the, of this door, where it requires the same exact key, I guess. Okay, so I know for a fact you have to turn left because I want to freaking see that crystal sage. Uh, and crystal lizard, is you going dead? Oh, damn it, really? Bam, there you go. Finally, awesome, awesome testicles. Alright, what is in there? Nothing. I guess. Whoa, whoa, you're gonna die. Oh, okay. Oh, what is you doing here? Whoa, what is you doing? Oh, whoa, 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 Okay, look at you getting a guard. Um, and also I forgot to speak about something uh, after I backstab this guy. Apparently, uh, the hovel set is almost complete, as you can see. Um, what is pretty much left is the headpiece, which I'll be taking some time off, uh, a little bit of time off after this episode, after this session, basically. And um, what I'm gonna do? Ooh, lizards, lizards every single where. Whoa, 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 whoa! What is that? Those freaking give me death, really? Really? A bunch of hands that are that are probably just you know harassing, sexually harassing my nipples are gonna kill me, really? I, mean, I guess that would be in real life. But yes, like I said about Havel set, I am not. A complete in terms of weight because I am a person that likes to have heavyweight uh, armor whilst being able to still dodge roll and crap like that. Let me grab this item, please. Thank you very much. Oh, thank you very much for the scale. Well, you rapist raping hands. So, it has been always something that I've been stuck to since Dark Souls 1 and 2. I've I, I'm, a, I'm a big fan of being, you know, being big and burly and bulky. You know, I like having heavy-ass weapons and heavy-ass armor. Um, I just didn't really follow the heavy-ass weapon quote that I said. It, it says Dark Souls 1 and 2. But if you see me from games that have similar aspects as Dark Souls, like, you know, like Monster Hunter, which I've definitely played and I definitely love, you can see me, I'm using big-ass weapons like a great... A great sword, hammers, and occasionally, you know, some lighter, faster. Whoa. Okay. Okay, now we're back. Okay, let me just get my souls back. Um, 
Fuck you all. First of all. Fuck. Oh my god, there's so much going on. What is going on? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. What is going on? This is a freaking. Whoa. What is going on? Like, literally, what's going on? Okay, so what I was speaking about it. I've always stuck to heavy ass stuff, if I remember that. Because I, cause I didn't really record myself going back here. I just stopped the recording button. I just trying to re I'm, I'm trying to recall what I was talking about. Oh, this is elevator. Is this a good one going back there? To the bonfire? Is it? Oh no, it's not it's something else. Okay then. Oh, that's a gate. I don't want to go there yet, but yeah, you can see me in some games that are that has RPG aspects and elements to it. I'm a big fan of you know big ass stuff, and but also while having big ass stuff, I want to be able to be as mobile as possible or as dodgy as possible. Being able to dodge with a big ass weapon is something that I've. That I find a real, a really, you know, badass. You know, I, I find a real badass. In, in my eyes. Just die in one shot. Whoa, 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 get away from me. There you go. Oh, I survived. I survived your shenanigans. So, yes. It is not that hard. I just have to pretty much, you know, be careful from now. Because last time I died there, like I said, this is not a safe place to begin with. That's why I need to, I need to walk through. Not to speed things up in terms of the whole game. I don't want to speed run a boss fight, which is not possible for me <laughs> because I tend to die a few times from each boss. Um, but in terms of you know mazes like this, I I, I really need one, and uh, it's it's no doubt that I would probably get lost and take so much time from a video. And the main purpose is to progress in the story, not to freaking beat the maze. Okay, this is our gargoyles. I've seen you before in Analondo back centuries ago. So, what the hell is that? Whoa. Whoa. There you go, finally dead. Oh, what? Oh, okay then. Okay then, I just stabbed your face. I mean, I smashed your face. I crushed your face. I fucking annihilated, rapingly destroyed your face. Okay, so let's go here. Ooh, more lizards, I see. What the fuck is that? Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, there's someone right behind me. I feel it. I feel it, but I. You fucking asshole. Come the. F Come here. Come here. Come here, you little piece of shit! There you go. Oh, 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 oh. Let me just get rid of that dialogue right there. Okay, thank you very much. Let me just run away from you because I don't have time for your shit. Let me just go ahead. Okay, he doesn't seem to be aggro to me anymore. That seems really nice. Okay. Is there any more lizards that want to be killed? Is there more of those gargoyle guys? I bet so. I think so. I probably. I, I'm confident there will be more. Tighten that chunk. Oh sh! So pretty. There you go. Run, 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 run. There you go. Finally, good. Good. What's this? Ooh, some upgrades from my Ashen. My Ashen. I mean my Esther's mask. Okay, let's just move on over here. And what is going on over here? Any items that are waiting for me to obtain? Let me just move my chair. There you go. Whoa, those are some guys that are probably going to take some time to kill, ain't it? Let me get my crossbow, shall we? And, uh, let me just. Those are three dangerous looking people. So, let me get rid of that. Okay, so... 
Okay, so he has a poisonous goddamn born arrow. Okay, okay. Oh, come on, man. You're three! And you all have ranged weapons. Maybe not for that guy holding the axe, but still. You have a sorcerer and an archer. Okay, he, he's almost dead. Oh, come on, man. Why'd you stop? Oh, my God. Good thing Hollow's armor is against. Oh, yes. Okay, you know I'm just gonna make it, make it like run, run, run. Can I get this, please? No. Okay, okay, fine, fine. I don't care. I don't care. Oh, is this is another fader. Is that the one going back to the bonfire? Let me just go there. I don't care anymore. Let me just go, please. Okay. God damn it. This is the problem with drinking so much water in a day. Which is good, but you know, I have to go to the bathroom. Oh! So this is the bonfire. Okay. Okay! I'll go back to Filing Shrine and take a, a little bathroom break and uh, catch you guys in the next episode. Goodbye.